This is Receipts, the game show from Revolt and Walmart that's all about celebrating black and unlimited people reimagining black excellence. It's a competition between your favorite entertainers, culture curators, and you at home to see who can guess the unexpected identities of some seemingly ordinary shoppers. You are doing a phenomenal job. Bad. beautiful people. This is Receipts, the game show to put the spotlight on some extremely talented people with limitless potential, just like myself. Oh, and la gente que está en la casa, that mean the people that's at home too. Yes, boo. As you can see from around here, we show up and show out. I'm so amped, y'all, because we might just take y'all to church today with the great spirits that our guests have. This first contestant must truly believe that all things are possible because he's an American rapper, singer, songwriter, New York Times best-selling author, four-time Grammy Award-winning artist, representing H-Town, and that's Houston and heaven. Hallelujah! Give it up for your boy, Lecrae! That's right, that's right, that's me, I'm here. That's my government name, too, you got it right. It means a lot, you know what I'm saying? Oh, he looks so angelic. Well, thank you, thank you, I do my best. You might recognize this award-winning sister from her work on the Today Show or her podcast, More Than That, which earned her her first NAACP Image Award nomination. One of DC's finest, give it up for my girl, Gia Pepper. Hi, sister! Yaddy, 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 yaddy. Yay. I see we're matching in our blue. You very much. But I also got on cream with Thank Lecrae. You. Thank, you. Thank you. He wanna be like us, don't he not like us. They, they not, not like, like us. <laughs> <laughs> now, before we get into the game, Lecrae, mm. let the congregation know what makes you black and unlimited. Well, Obviously, I'm black. Uh -huh. True. But what makes me unlimited, you know, besides all of the things you read on my resume, which are amazing things, I'm grateful for all of the okay. opportunities that God has given me. Amen. But more than that, mm -hmm. the unlimited aspect of me is, man, let me tell y'all something. I work for Walmart. You know, I used to work for Walmart. Wait a minute. You know what I'm saying? So you thing? should be a pro at this game then. I mean, are we stocking items? Because <laughs> I can do that. You Hopefully, you're going to stock these answers. Yeah, I'm good. Answer. I can do that. I can, OK. OK, Gia, how about you? What makes you black and unlimited? You know, coming up in D.C., which mm -hmm. used to be the chocolate city, I really was able to see black people in every step of life. Mm -hmm. And I always loved just being a black person because mm -hmm. I would look around and see black doctors, black lawyers. I didn't even know people didn't have black doctors. It was so amazing to know that from that time, mm -hmm. I literally was tasked to be unlimited, be all the best I could be just mm. from being in that area, growing up in a family that asked me for excellence and showed me how to walk it in the same way because I got to watch them do it. Mm. Well, yeah. listen, <laughs> I hope y'all both came to play because this battle is not the Lord's, it's yours. Huh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Look, just in case it's y'all first time here at Receipts, we're all about letting our contestants and you at home battle it out to uncover the unexpected identities of some unassuming shoppers. And let's now welcome our black and unlimited shopping brother, Brian Daniels. Hello, what's up, Brian? Hello, hello. Brian. Yes. Uh, Brian, tell everybody a little bit about who you are. Well, my name is Brian Daniels. I'm originally from Seattle, Washington. I'm ambitious. I am a go-getter and I'm multifaceted. And of course, most importantly, I'm black and I'm limited. Guys, let's look at what the choices are for his identity. Knife thrower, deep sea fisherman, sushi chef, nutritionist, or food critic. There's only one way to find out Brian's identity. Let's check the receipt. In this first round, each contestant will have 60 seconds to guess as many of the first 15 items on Brian's shopping receipt based on the clues that he gives. You'll get 10 points for each correct answer. We've got a coin to toss right here to see who's first, or you can choose to pass it off to your opponent. Okay, y'all ready? Yes. Well, Gia. A retoss, re, re flip. That was a bad flip. No. Psych, Gia. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> would you like to take this or pass it off to Lecrae? Pass it to Lecrae. Oh. Wow, so you get to do it anyway. Okay, so keep in mind it is one through 15. You ready? I'm ready. Okay, when you say the number, he'll begin giving clues and your time starts then. Number one, uh, it's something, it's a grain. 
that you often use for a side dish for pretty much any meal you can rice. think of. What color? Brown rice, white rice. Ooh. Number two. Uh, so if I make a baked potato, I gotta wrap it in. Foil, mm. aluminum foil. Mm. foil. Number three. Mm -hmm. You wash your clothes with? Bleach, uh, detergent. Uh, boom. Number four. You also wash your white clothes with? Bleach. Mm. Number five. Hot sauce, what's, what's, what's hot sauce? Wasabi. A sauce. Oh, uh, Louisiana. No, something a little more Texas Asian Pete. infused maybe. What? Do you want to skip? Skip. All right. Number six. To my loo. Um, most people, if they like their proteins cooked, they usually want them grilled. Well done. Medium. Another option of cooking. Uh, fried. Usually, boom. Fried. The first thing involves a particular type of protein, which is in the water. It's called fried meat. fish. Bingo. Oh, ah, right. you got it. Uh -huh. yeah, I, would, I know about some fish fries. That's what I'm talking about. The enemy will not win today. Huh? We came to play. Okay, we definitely got to give a shout out to this good Black and Unlimited brand, yes. Ecos. Okay, they're yes. like yes. shout out to Ecos. Popping. All right, Gia, let's go ahead and see if you can put some hoist up on the board. Let's go. It starts when you say your number. Okay, seven. A sauce you use mm, usually on Fourth of July. Barbecue. Bingo. Nice. Eight. I write with this. Pencil, pen. Boom. Mm. Next number? Nine. These are tools you use in the kitchen to cut things Knives. With. How many of them are there? Ooh, what do we call that group of... Set of knives. Bingo. Ah, <laughs> ten. <laughs> we just gonna give them away. Ten. Um, they gave you white rice. Right. Uh, go ten. to like a, a store, I'm looking for like... Mm, this is actually kind of difficult to describe. Uh, Eleven. Pack. Eleven. Boom. Let's do that. Um, I put my food into this to keep it temperature controlled. Oven? And it rolls. I would take it maybe on a hike oh. to keep my fish oh, 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 or whatever. Cooler. Cooler. Boom. Next. Uh, 11, 12, 12, 12, 12. 12? Oh, this is going to be difficult. If I'm making a cake, this is one of the ingredients I probably use. Yeah! Wow. Yeah! Lecrae, you have 50 and Gia has 40. Oh. It's just one. And as y'all can see, we have another black and unlimited brain right here. Scott's barbecue sauce. Scott's. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Mm. Okay, but it's still very early, so let's keep getting all up in Brian's shopping cart and ask Brian to show me what you got. Brian's gone shopping for a very specific purpose and has forgotten one key item, but it's cool because he knows he can order it online and Walmart will deliver the missing item right to his front door. That's a real thing. Each of you have been given identical baskets with all the items that he purchased. Using his clues, the first person to correctly guess what is missing will receive 20 points. And you'll get 10 bonus points if you identify the one item he needs to put back on the shelf because what is it doing there? Okay, so remember guys, this may or may not have anything to do with Brian's identity, but it's definitely for the culture. You've got only 30 seconds, so Brian, what is the first clue? Before I lost mine back in the day, I like to look good, so I'd sport this to cause a ripple effect. Are we Wait. guessing now? You, your do rag. Y'all got thirty seconds. Y'all should okay. go through there. You need a do rag. Yes, tell and us you ain't what. Got, you don't need some shaving cream. Well, maybe is you it do rag? It is wave cap. Wave cap, do rag. Okay, same saying. thing. Keep going. Keep going. <laughs> is there anything in there he, he should have left? left? Maybe you need a wax stick. I don't know how that. Is. You got a wax stick. Does he need that? No, 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 you don't need a wax stick. Oh, yeah, wax. He, he don't need the wax stick. Okay, you don't need a wax stick. Because no I use the wax stick to lay my hair. Hey, yeah. I don't, hair. Even, I don't even know what okay, the wax stick is. Okay, so you got the wave cap. Who got the wax stick? Us. Let me check with my team. Check with your sources. Look, I got both. Gia oh. got none. All right, y'all, so basket number two. Brian, what you got? This dish I'm fixing got to be fine because everyone is going to ask who made it. Y'all can start pulling now. Oh, this got to go. Potato salad. This got to go. Potato salad, raisins, get, 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 them, get them out of here. Raisins can go. If okay. raisins is involved, we don't want raisins. them. Is that right? The, the we raisins. don't want no raisins. Okay. We don't want no raisins. We what don't want no forget? raisins. What did he forget for the potato salad? Uh, uh, mayonnaise. You forgot Ooh. mayonnaise. You got that too? You grocery shopping. Stop shopping. Start guessing. I don't know you this round. This round you I gave up. shopping. You're like, mm, look at I this potato. Know. This it's is a much. nice potato. This is, look at this. Wow. <laughs> OK, well, here's a quick look at the score. Lecrae has 110, and Gia has 40. Mm. 
Golly. You're doing a phenomenal job. Well, thank you. you are doing a phenomenal job. <laughs> it's going well. You could clap too. Oh, I am. We got to go pay some bills. So go on and tap on your neighbor and say, neighbor, we'll be right back. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Receipts. We may not come on when you want us, but we're always here on time. <laughs> and we're the only game show that spotlights the extraordinary potential of black and unlimited people like you at home. I've got Lecrae and Gia all up in Brian's shopping cart trying to guess his identity. And it's time to secure the bag. Each of these Walmart bags features another item on Brian's receipt. For every multiple choice answer you get correct, you get 20 points. And you get to select one bag. You'll have five seconds to write the correct answer. Y'all ready? Yes. All right, so? Thank you. Presentation is important, so I keep this with me to stay fresh and get rid of the mess. Is it A, air freshener, B, a mop, or C, a trash can? Time is ticking. All right, want to reveal what you guys say? Ooh, Lecrae got good news. You're wrong. Oh. <laughs> You're right, Ms. Hallelujah. Wow. <laughs> you bless God for something. Oh, hello. <laughs> Go on. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Sometimes I need this to wipe down my workplace shoulders, chest, pants, and shoes. Is it A, a sponge, B, a towel, or C, a chamois? Good news is you're both right. Okay, next question. I have to keep this with me to stay organized and communicate no matter if I'm in the middle of the ocean, at home, or with a client. Is it A, a laptop, B, a notebook, or C, a radio? Uh. Oh, actually you're both wrong. Dang. Wow. Okay, so that means Lecrae, you get one bag, and Gia, you get to pick two. Okay. So Lecrae, you can go ahead and pick your one bag out of one, two, or three. I'm going with three. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm saying? Father, Father, Father son, son, and a holy, holy ghost. ghost. Hey. Ah, yeah. the trifecta. Thank you. Yes, sir. Mm. Like All that. right, and Gia, which two bags would you like to have? I'll take one and three. Mm. Okay. So remember guys, inside of your bag, this is supposed to help you guys come closer to revealing his identity. Okay. I got one. Okay, Lecrae, you have 130. And Gia, you have 80. Hopefully oh you do make it towards the end of the game though. Okay, cause I'm, come on. What is the name of this church? This okay. is the church of Lala Milan and receipts. Hallelujah. Okay. Thank you. It, it do look like she's about to preach with that. Yes, oh, yeah. Do y'all like my pose? <laughs> We're going to do communion later. Okay. I got some bread in the back. Okay. So let's remind everyone of the options for Brian's identity. We have a knife thrower, a deep sea fisherman, a sushi chef, a nutritionist, or a food critic. Now, you can test if your hunch is right. It's time to play facts or cash. In this round, Brian will give clues from his shopping experience, and you guys have to guess whether it's facts or cap. If it's true, you'll say facts. That's facts. If it's false, you'll say that's cap. That, just like that, Yo. Gia. <laughs> These should help clue you into Brian's identity. You'll get 30 points for each one you buzz in and get correct, and the person to get the most right in 90 seconds wins the exclusive black card right here. Ooh. Expensive. On this black card will be an identity that it is not, which will hopefully help you guys come closer to knowing his identity. The clock will start after Brian gives his first clue. I bought some sunscreen for the long days I stay out for a catch. Great. Facts. Wrong. All right, come on. Is not my answer. Cap keep going, is keep actually going, keep going, keep going. The first aid kit I bought comes in handy sometimes if I get caught slipping. Miss. Facts. You're correct. All right, next question. I needed some extra plastic cutlery, so I picked up a box. Cap. Correct. Whoa, whoa, he didn't uh, call you yet. But I, he, I saw come his on. hand moving in my ahead, direction. Ahead, this ahead. is correct. Okay. Next, all of my ingredients together taste good and are also nutritious. Miss Gia. Cat. Fact. Oh, sorry. 
Next, I ordered life jackets online for people I have joined me for the first time. Look right. Cap. It is cap. Wow. Big cap. I cap. bought some hot sauce because it's the best flavor to bring the heat to my main dish. Miss Gia. Fast. Cap. Whoa. Next, I bought a dragon action figure to use as a decorative display. Look right. Captain Crunch. <sighs> Factual. Wow. I bought wood to create an area for target practice. Ms. Gia. Facts. Oh. With 60 points, this round goes to Lecrae. Gia, you got 30, so that means Lecrae is going to get the black card. If you want to be kind to your neighbor, you can show her, or you can be selfish. It's up to you. Oh, I wouldn't have guessed that. That's crazy. I mean, I thought this might have been the answer. Wow, so that did help you. Nah. Ah. That's crazy, though. That's that, Christian like. It's not uh, is That it. isn't. Y'all working, working on me. Y'all working on me. OK, well, it looks like we have a score of 190 for Lecrae and 110 for Gia. Well, Brian, thank you so much for letting us check your receipt. But now it's time for you to reveal your identity. Thank you so much. All right. See y'all soon. All right. So one last time, let's take a look at the options for Brian's identity. We have a knife thrower, deep sea fisherman, sushi chef, nutritionist, or a food critic. Lecrae already knows at least one of them he is not from your black card. Yes, I do. And I feel like the Lord been working on me as I've been sitting here. Won't he do it? And I feel like, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going I'm to go ahead. I'm going to share what I saw. Yeah. Because so it's yes. you know what I'm saying, I you know, it's oh, a game. Thank you. Wow. Thank it's a you. game. It's a game. This is why we love you. Gia, did that help you in That did help me. You have 10 seconds to make a final decision and write down what you think Brian's black and unlimited identity is. If you guess right, you get 50 points, and the person with the most points is crowned king or queen of receipts. And go! Stop looking over here. Ain't nobody looking over Stop here. Stop looking at my thing. Uh -uh. This is not fifth grade. <laughs> On the count of three, let's see y'all guesses. Y'all ready? Yes. Yeah. One, two, and three. New transitionist is what mine probably says, but it's uh, supposed no, to say nutritionist. Say it's oh, supposed to say nutritionist. Oh, okay. Deep sea fisherman and nutritionist. Let's see who's taking home the victory today because it's time to reveal Brian's identity. Right after this break, <laughs> don't go nowhere. We'll be right back. Welcome back to Receipts, the game where we spark the celebration of black and unlimited people doing a really cool things. The competition is lit. The score is Lecrae 190 and Gia 110. Let's go ahead and remind everyone what you guys said the identity of our shopper Brian was. Gia, you said a deep sea fisherman. You said a nutritionist, right, Lecrae? Right, but that's that's what I know it's not. So what do you really think it is? I really think he's a deep sea fisherman. Okay. Who All makes right. sushi on the side. The good news is one of you could be a winner. The bad news is both of you could be wrong. Oh wow. Brian? Come on out and show us what makes you black and unlimited. Oh! Wow. You a liar, bro. A deep sea fisherman who makes sushi. I said wow. that. That's what I said. I am a sushi chef. Yeah. Wow. How do we do? I guessed it. That's looking like no one to know so far. Fisherman. I get it. The white rice. That's the what I said. Foil. The bleach. Aluminum foil used a lot for torching eel. Laundry detergent. Gotta clean up, uh, you know. Okay. I'm shook. I'm impressed. But I'm also hungry. <laughs> Towels to clean up. How did you get started? So, probably about 10 years ago now, I was a host at a sushi restaurant, Ooh. and the head chef asked me if I was interested in learning how to make sushi. Uh, about two years into it, like anybody else, you get good at what you do, and you just kind of want to branch out on your own. Mm -hmm. So I did. Uh, obviously doing odd jobs along with my business, my ninja. My ninja? And, you, That's what it's called. My ninja. Correct. He is my G. It's oh. good. That's very For those good. that know, it's a wink to the fans that know. Now that his identity has been checked out, let's see Brian in action right here. My name is Brian Daniels. I'm a private sushi chef. I'm originally from Seattle, Washington, but I've lived most of my life in Atlanta. 
I fell in love with sushi making, the process of it, the diligence, really kind of encapsulated it. It kept me focused and it was just something I wanted to pursue. I know that I'm probably the first black sushi chef that people will ever meet. And I take that very seriously. Uh, I try to set a good example. I am ambitious, I am multifaceted, I am focused, and most importantly, I am black and unlimited. Oh, wow. Crazy. That was crazy. crazy. Shout out to you for being black and unlimited. So let's go ahead and take one final look at the scoreboard. Why? With the final score of Lecrae having 190 and Gia, we don't have, yeah. okay, we won't even say it. The victory belongs to Lecrae! Yes. I ain't no hater, congratulations. Anyways, Brian, to celebrate you being black and unlimited, we passed around a collection plate and guess what we gonna give you today? You tell me. A thousand dollar Walmart Woo! gift card! Hey. Yes! It's been a great game, everybody. <laughs> but before I give the benediction, oh. shout out to my guests, Lecrae and Gia, for playing with us today. And of course, shout out to all of you beautiful people at home for joining in too. Remember, in whatever it is you aspire to do, you have the unlimited potential too. Until we play again, keep the faith and do you, boo. We'll see you all next time on Receive! Oh.